Hey fam, Pixel here. Pixel hopes to give you a bit of an edge into the market and equip you with some tools that'll help you maximize how efficient you are in the market. And the main tool or process today would be how do we identify the people who bought in early in a new cycle or a new meta and then track their wallets and get notifications for when they buy other tokens, NFTs, or in general, do different things. So in this video, we will identify wallets who bought Pepe early and then put those wallet addresses into another tool that will send us notifications when those wallets do transactions. You can go further in detail by potentially delving deeper into these wallets and curating the ones that you track. Last cycle Pixel made a lot of money by only following specific wallets that Pixel knew would print money. And it had some sort of loop back where other people were following those same wallets and we would all jump on as data lords and people later would be flocking in. Because in reality, in these metas, this can go up another 10x, but you really wanna be entering over here. Pixel does suggest the fade here or just buy smaller amounts, but if you were able to buy a small amount down here, you would have sizable gains later. So as everyone knows, Pepe's been doing the rounds. We're gonna use just Pepe as the example, but you could use this for anything if there's another meta in the future we want to try and find the wallets that are buying it early so we can get notifications on them because you probably only heard of pepe after it already did 100x so we're going to click on the efferscan button on the pepe website there's other ways we can find this maybe on their twitter through dex tools but pixel likes to just go to their direct website so we go to the efferscan we need to go to the token tracker rather than the contract page. So we go to the token tracker. And what we want to do is we want to view all of the transactions and download the CSV report of all of them. If we look here, we want to identify potentially everyone who bought from the 16th of April and before. So what we'll do is we'll filter to the 16th of April and download the CSV file. Okay, now that we have the CSV downloaded, we're gonna go click over here on the one on this far left, if you can see the cursor. And we're going to add a filter. We're going to scroll over to where it says method. We're going to deselect all. We're going to type in swap. And we're going to get rid of a few of these. To see all of the transactions of people buying for those days. And so we can see who's some of these first early transactions on the 14th of the 4th, this person in the two column bought 2.5 trillion Pepe. And we can't quite see how many F they spent, but if we copy the TX hash in this first column and we go back to Efferscan and search this, at, this TX hash. We can see more details. So they only spent $25 worth of Ethereum, but today that's now worth $955,000, nearly a million. As you can see here, they swapped that amount of F for that amount of Pepe. So for 
this next part of the uh, I guess guide we will just track this person's wallet but pixel would suggest and just for the saving of time you should look at all of these different wallets and then have a look into some further details by kind of like going to their F address and then seeing what else do they do look at their transactions what are they buying are they a good trader you might even be able to paste this ethereum address into metamask portfolio to see what their wallet looks like and but we're gonna use a kind of like bot to give us notifications on telegram about when this address buys in the future so now this is the tool that's going to give us notifications for when these wallets do transactions. They do have paid plans, but Pixel just likes these guys because you can track up to 20 wallets. If you make a bunch of money, you might consider giving these guys a higher subscription, but look, Pixel doesn't think you really need to. You don't need to be tracking more than 20 wallets. You should really be just tracking a bunch of wallets that are high quality. Um, Pixel doesn't know this team at all. This is not a sponsored ad. Pixel would suggest you go look in the market and see if there's any other better versions of this. Pixel just likes this because it works on Telegram and Pixel's community is on Telegram in the spaceport. So Pixel can check the spaceport and also check Pixel's notifications for the wallets that Pixel tracks. But anyway, you click get started. It'll pop this up and then you can open Telegram on your desktop. You're obviously going to need telegram so let's go open up telegram now here we go and we can click just the start bottom down here we're going to click the add button and we're going to add a wallet we can leave all these checked but most probably we only want to be checking on a specific chain but it's fine to check all chains. We'll click done. And now it's asking us for the address. So we can go back to that spreadsheet. But obviously you might, or you might have a different spreadsheet with wallets that you've done some due diligence on. But we're just going to use this address for now. And we're going to paste that into Telegram. So there's the address. We click enter going to add, well I added this before but I gave it a label Pepe Buyer, it will ask you for a label and we type in Pepe Buyer, perfect so now it's tracking and I think Pixel would love to show you what it looks like when they do a transaction but it's probably going to make the video too long. Pixel was just about to wrap up and a notification came through just to show how it looks. So this wallet spent $700 on some booty and we can click on the TX hash. And look at some more details of this coin. And if we go deeper you could even copy this address up here or over here and go into Dex Tools, paste it in and see what the chart looks like. So it just launched literally five minutes ago and its market cap is only 12k, which is weird. Oh yeah. It's got 100% liquidity at the moment, but who knows? This could be an outright scam, so don't, don't go buying this coin, but this just shows you an example that how early you could be. And there you have it, fam. If you were struggling to find a way to get an edge on the market, this is a good place to start. Pixel doesn't really suggest doing this type of stuff in a bear trend. To be honest, Pixel hasn't really 
had an interest in tracking wallets for the last year just because Pixel was in survival mode and thought trading was not the right risk reward. But now that Pixel sees that the market is a little more risk on, it's much more interesting to be using tools like this and to delve deeper because small amounts of purchases on highly risky stuff can make you a lot of money. And if you're you have the ability to sift through all of the bullshit by tracking the right wallets it will be very valuable for you so pixel suggests do this on other coins that you saw pump hard in the last few days maybe it's peepo maybe it's chad and see if some of these wallets that bought in the first day bought each of these different coins and they're your high quality ones. Pixel really recommends it. It was very lucrative for Pixel last cycle and Pixel will start doing it more often now. Anyway, love you fam. Really appreciate you. See you in the spaceport.